things I'm doing right now to hit my profit goals in 2024 as a seven figure business owner, part three. Okay, so the third thing that I'm doing is I'm setting clear goals and objectives. I'm talking about financial targets. I'm talking about client acquisition goals. And here's the thing. So let me give you an example of some of these financial targets. So one of the targets that we look at, the first target is called the freedom figure. So that's like that big number that you need to make next year. What I like to say is to feel free, right? And then when you have that big figure, now you have other targets that make up that big figure. Everyone's business is different. So like for me, I have client acquisition goals. I have speaker contracts that I want to get, right? Another um, clear goal and objective that we're setting is market expansion. You might want to expand into new markets. We're doing that, right? So we want to be able to get some new corporate contracts. And because that's one of our goals and we set that market expansion goal, that now helped me make the decision that we're going to start marketing on LinkedIn next year to help us be in alignment, right? And better position to reach that goal. And so you, if you've been following me for any amount of time, or if you're bouncing up on me for the news for the first time, what up? You always hear me talk about making data driven decisions. And now I want to show you an example. So because we're in the middle of, you know, planning for 2024 and setting these clear goals or whatever, we looked at some numbers the other day and I'm like, Woo! And I had to make some decisions. And I want to share my screen and show you exactly what that looks like. So if you want me to do that, drop me a comment, okay? And for anybody who's listening to me, if you feel like I'm too new and I'm not sure if, you know, I am supposed to be setting these type of goals, let me be clear. You should be planning at your level. The answer is always yes. You should always be setting clear goals and objectives. But your goals and objectives are going to look different than someone else's, okay? I am sharing with you what my goals and objectives look like, okay? So that's the third thing that we're doing. Again, leave me a comment if you want that part two, and I'll see you in the next one.